What's happening, guys? Kevin here from SportsBoxBreaks.com, coming at you live Thursday night, November 5th, 2020. We are busting our first case of the brand new release, the 2020 Panini National Treasures Baseball. This is case break number one. The product came out yesterday. Of course, we had another shipping snafu with our uh, distributors, so I do appreciate the patience Waiting until tonight to get this one filled up and broken, guys. All right, who has who in the break? Arizona Diamondbacks belong to Dean E. The Atlanta Braves going to Travis S. The Baltimore Orioles going to Brian B. Boston Red Sox going to Doug F. The Chicago Cubbies going to Kyle W. Chicago White Sox, Aaron F. Cincinnati Reds going to Alan K. Cleveland Indians going to Joe D. Colorado Rockies going to Mike T. The Detroit Tigers, Aaron F. The Houston Astros going to Jeremy W. Uh, Kansas City Royals going to Robert T. The Los Angeles Angels going to Doug F. The L.A. Dodgers also going to Doug F. The Miami Marlins going to Aaron F. The Milwaukee Brewers, Mike T. Minnesota Twins, Doug F. New York Mets going to Doug F. New York Yankees going to Tom G. The Oakland A's going to Doug F. Philadelphia Phils going to Mike T. The Pittsburgh Pirates going to Jeremy T. San Diego Padres, which I believe were the last team picked up to close it out, going to Bill M. Thank you for that pickup, Bill. San Francisco Giants going to Tony K. The Seattle Mariners, Aaron F. St. Louis Cardinals going to Luke N. Tampa Bay Rays going to Jeremy T. The Texas Rangers going to Torian T. Uh, Toronto Blue Jays going to Arthur L. And the Washington Nationals going to Doug F. Guys, I was showing this before we started, but... In addition to the sealed case, which I have sitting right here, I have one single box, sealed box of NT Baseball, that is for sale on the website as a personal box. It's not often we get these premium ones like that as a uh, personal box. So if you guys want in, it is on the website in the personal box section. Over $100 uh, discount versus what you're going to find it out there on the market. So if you want to snag it up, our price is $509.99. I think they're like... 640 something like that maybe over on blowout david adams and all that good stuff all right here we go guys four box case coming up panini has like uh almost looks like double panini tape on top and there's the bottom let's open it from the bottom here we go good luck good luck all right you guys watched any of it? How's it looking? It's a hit or miss kind of product. You know, Panini Baseball is hit or miss to begin with, and you get into the high end stuff, but it's always super solid. It's always really nice looking stuff. All right, there it is. Four boxes. They seem like they've got like a cloth. You'll see it when I open this. They seem like they have a cloth texture. Usually, the NT product is like wooden boxes. Jeremy, what's happening, buddy? But check that out. I don't know if you can see it, if it translates well on camera. It's got like a cloth texture over the wooden box. Maybe it's not wood this time. Actually, it's not. It feels like it's like a hard cardboard with like a cloth texture over it. Okay. Here we go. So I'm going to break it down to the individual boxes like that, make it a little easier to work with on the old break table here. And guys, if you're out there just kind of kicking the tires, uh, considering jumping in, prices go up, quality goes down, and the quality even including the wood boxes, right? Um, jump on in, folks. The prices are as good as you're going to see them out there. We did a huge price reduction on this stuff the night before the release. Like some teams that were over $200 were dropped almost 100 full bucks. So one more case of this product filling up. That is going to be with Jason when he's back. I only have the one case here. I have it up on screen just to promote it and get some visual on it. So it's up there. We're promoting it, but it's going to be when Jason comes back. All right, fourth box. Here we go. Yeah, Jeremy, are you guys fully home and everything? I'm assuming you are, right? All right, four boxes. Our breakdown per box, I think it's eight autos or relics, right? I think that's the breakdown in the NT. I'm going to take a quick look so I'm not reading off incorrect info. 
So each box contains eight autos or memorabilia cards. So it's uh, either or. So eight hits in the form of an auto or a relic. Still in the NICU? Gotcha. All right. First box here, guys. Exciting stuff. Let's find some crazy stuff here. Every card, the last card, I could see it already. I don't know who it is. The last card is going to be a redemption. All right, let's start the party. Of course, every card ships. That goes without saying. This is not a product that has a ton of cards, but I'll say it anyway. Let me get the camera focused in. All right, first at the top, what do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, uh, seven relic pieces here. Gavin Lux, 60 of 99. Dodgers on the board right away for Doug. Got a Game Gear Relic card. Game Gear Relic, you got Bat Relic up top. 60 of 99. Got a Colossal Relic. 86 of 99. Christian Vasquez for Boston. <clears throat> you know what? I actually did a rebuild on my computer and my graphics are on an external drive. My little uh, all card ship graphic. I got to get him off the external drive so I can be obnoxious and display it again. So Vasquez for Boston. That's going to Doug as well. So Doug getting the first two out of the gate here. 86 of 99 Colossal Relic of Vasquez for Boston. All right, we got another Game Gear. And how about another Boston? This is the Doug F. Show. Zeus scoring another one for the Boston spot. We got a little Xander. Uh, what do we got? Octo Relic. Xander, 46 of 72, a little Octo Relic action. Game Gear for Boston. All right. Well, this is interesting. How about Babe Ruth? Game Gear Materials, 8 of 10. So the New York Yankees spot in this one was, you know, a pretty big boy spot. Tom picked it up, getting a little Babe Ruth action to 10. Very cool. Very cool. Game Gear Materials of Babe Ruth, 8 of 10. And now we start seeing some ink. I see ink on the next one in the stack. What do we got? <clears throat> Rico Garcia, San Francisco, 66 of 99. San Fran going to Tony. So the first bit of ink is going to Tony. We got a dual relic auto, 66 of 99. Rico Garcia, Game Gear Material Signatures. All right. Next one is looking pretty cool also. I don't know if they're calling them silhouettes. What do they actually call it? Does it say on the back? Yeah, rookie silhouette signatures of Barrera for Washington. Going to Doug. Nice card, Doug. It's like an acetate finish on it. It's on card ink. 45 of 99. Rookie. Silhouette signatures. Rookie silhouette signatures of Barrera. So Washington with the beauty right there. Next up, we got a Willie Castro. Nice jumbo patch going on there. Two-color patch on card ink, 7 of 99 for Detroit. Detroit going to Aaron. I think Aaron picked this one up tonight, or did you pick it up yesterday, Aaron? 7 of 99. Willie Castro, Detroit on the board. Check this out. That's a cool card. What do we got? American Autographs of Alex Bregman for Houston going to Jeremy W. And that is to uh, 99, 47 of 99. Really cool looking card. Alex Bregman, Houston. American Autographs. And uh, shall we do this? Let's use a blank uh, spacer to lead us in so we see this a little bit slower than just a flash reveal, right? All right, National Treasures. <laughs> it's a booklet in redemption form. Okay, Decades Booklet. Card number three. We have a Beltre, CC Sabathia, Cole Hamels, Kurt Schilling, Kerry Wood, and Ryan Zimmerman. Holy cow. I believe we're definitely going to be looking at multi team on this one. So, Decades Booklet, right? Interesting. So, yeah, the Decades Booklet Multiplayer 
I'm looking at the print run is to 16, right? So we're looking at, just trying to figure out team designations because Beltre is showing up in the checklist for the Rangers and the Red Sox. So this one's going to be interesting to figure out uh, who gets. We're going to put it through the randomizer. So Beltre Sabathia. So we'll do the randomizer on that, of course, at the end. I'll figure out who goes into the randomizer team-wise. And again, you guys can uh, feel free to chime in. But again, it's going to be a little interesting. I'll have to do a little research on the checklist once we get through the rest of the three boxes and figure out how the randomizer gets set up. So hang tight. That'll be done in the uh, second video when we randomize it up. Crazy stuff. This one's thick. Check this out. We might have a live booklet going on here. Live booklet, maybe? All right. We do. <clears throat> we do. The last card is a booklet in this one. So live booklet going to be happening. All right, Colossal Material. We got a three-color of Adrian Marejan. San Diego on the board. And I think that was the last team karma for Bill. Bill M. picked it up. There you go, Bill. Marejan, nice three-color patch. Numbering is to 25. 24 out of 25 on that one. All right, how about some Mets love here? 29 out of 49 on the Dwight Gooden. New York Mets going to Doug. 29 out of 49. Dwight Gooden Relic. Got an Acuna Jr. sighting here. Atlanta on the board for Travis. That's a nice black and white picture, too. Pretty cool. 32 out of 99. Acuna Jr. for Atlanta. Travis getting it. 32 of 99. All right, 41 of 99, Bat Relic of Alan Trammell. Detroit going to Aaron, 41 of 99 for Detroit. And, uh, well, one of the final teams left out there was the White Sox. Check this sickness out. That's an 8 of 10 on the numbering. Danny Mendick, beautiful-looking card right there for the White Sox and Aaron. Very, very nice. 8 of 10 on that one. A little number window. And inside the number window is a uh, pretty chunky patch going on there. Danny Mendick, 8 of 10 for the White Sox. Next. More ink. we got a treasured materials with ink. 19 out of 52 for Tampa Bay. The Tampa Bay spot going to Jeremy. Jeremy T. 19 out of 52, Austin Meadows. Treasured material. On card ink as well for Tampa Bay. I see, uh, I see something right there. I see something, but in front of it, let's check out this Logan Webb. Check that sick patch out. Check that sick patch out. Eleven out of forty-nine for San Fran. This is going to Tony. Beautiful patch auto, Tony. Logan Webb, San Francisco. So it's a printing plate. Auto, I don't know who it is. Well, let's look at it. I was going to say, let's look at it last, but the booklet's behind it. So here we go. Hall of Fame 2018. How about Vladimir Guerrero? One of one, boom. One of one, Vladimir Guerrero for Los Angeles. Both Los Angeles spots going to Doug. So Doug getting a Vladimir Guerrero printing plate auto, one of one. Congrats, sir. Nice hit. Beautiful hit. Beautiful hit. And the last card in this box is a Rookie Jumbo Signature Material, 44 of 99, Brendan McKay for Tampa Bay. And that's going to Jeremy T. Jeremy, there you go, buddy. Ink on the one side. You got your relic on the other side. It's like uh, it's got some dusty spots going on. Brendan McKay, Tampa Bay, our first live booklet, Rookie Signature Jumbo Material, Brendan McKay. All right, halfway through it, guys. I like it. I like it. 
The other one is probably going to sell out tonight, and I'm not going to have it to break for you guys, but I do have that personal box if you guys want to go for it. All right, here we go. Next one. All right, <clears throat> thick card, booklet. I think, does each one contain a booklet? I think so, right? Definitely a live booklet of some sort at the bottom of this stack. We got a Jordan Alvarez, Colossal, 66 of 99 for Houston. The Houston spot going to Jeremy W. So Alvarez with a Colossal. Another Colossal, nice patch right there. Lewis Thorpe, 4 of 25 from Minnesota. Minnesota going to Doug. Lewis Thorpe, nice patch there, Doug. How about this guy? How about a little Tatis action? Look at that. 8 of 25. It almost looks like a, a lace or something. Or is it like just piping? Like on a uniform piece? That's pretty uh, different. 8 of 25 on the Tatis San Diego. Going to Bill. Last team karma right there for you, Bill. Cal Ripken. How about a Cal Ripken relic 7 of 10 for Baltimore? Baltimore going to Brian B. Cal Ripken relic. I see something that looks pretty interesting here, guys. Printing plate. Patch auto. On card ink of Josh Rojas for Arizona, one of one. Arizona going to Dean. Arizona scoring a one of one. Check out that patch, that's a beauty. Good stuff, Arizona D-backs. So two printing plate, one of one so far. This one with relic and ink on it. Congrats, beautiful. Next, how about a little Susugo action here for Tampa Bay, dual relic auto. 49 of 99. Tampa Bay on the board again for Jeremy. Jeremy, Tampa Bay uh, pulling in some hits, buddy. Congrats, congrats. Here's Barrera again, this time to 99. 99 for Washington. Doug F. on it. 20 of 99. Three-color patch on card ink. Rookie action for Washington for Doug. Next one's a redemption, guys. I don't know who it is. I'm not even going to look. I'm keeping it intentionally out of sight for myself. And let's see what we got. <laughs> look at this. One of five legendary jumbo material booklet of Duke Snyder. So Dodger is going to be on the board for Doug. Number to five. So some old school Brooklyn Dodgers, which of course translate to the L.A. Dodgers. Duke Snyder. Let's use this again lead us in all right here we go here we go all right 2020 nt game gear material signatures so the game gear materials is that like the quads where it's like eight relic pieces i think so right card number 43 why not luis Robert, Luis Robert right there. Boom, White Sox for Aaron. Game Gear Material Signatures of Luis. Aaron F. coming in today, picking up that White Sox spot. Got us all the way sold out because the big teams got picked up. And getting rewarded. Congrats, buddy. Nice hit. Big boom. So Luis shows up in our first case of the product. How about it? Game Gear Material Signatures of Luis. Going to Aaron. All right, last box right here, guys. It's thick. It's real thick. Here we go. It's been a hot case. I mean, I still have to determine how the heck we're going to set up the random on this one. Again, because that Beltre is uh, carries across a couple different teams, so I got to figure that out and figure out which teams are going to be on that random setup. But we'll get it going. All right, empty box right there. Here we go. 
All right, first one up top here. How about White Sox? Just got that uh, Luis hit. Now another one. Dylan Cease for the White Sox. Colossal Relic. Chicago White Sox. One more time for Aaron. All right, Ichiro. 73 of 99. Seattle on the board with Relic. Seattle also going to Aaron. Ichiro Relic coming your way, Aaron. Little Kyle Schwarber action, triple relic here. Game gear, materials, triple relic, 40 of 99. For the Dodgers, which goes to Doug. Or no, I'm saying Dodgers, Chicago Cubbies. Cubbies going to Kyle W. Kyle W on that. Nolan Ryan showing up here. Houston, triple game gear. 22 out of 25. That's Jeremy W. Jeremy W. gets it. So a lot of game gear showing up in this one. And our first ink, social signature. So you have his Instagram handle here, Willie Castro. Social signatures to 99 for Detroit. Detroit going to Aaron. Social signatures. All right. It's different. We got Logan Allen for Cleveland. Four of 25. A little three-color patch auto action here. Cleveland going to who? Cleveland is going to Joe D. Joe D, 4 of 25 on the Logan Allen. Game Gear Material Signatures. Look at this patch. Look at that Houston patch. 75 of 99 on the Abraham Toro. Houston going to Jeremy W. 75 of 99 on this one. Very nice. Abraham Toro. Next one is old school. Treasured materials with ink. Check out the old school auto here. Elroy Face, 15 of 49. Yeah, great patch, terrible auto on the previous card. This one, however, great auto, mediocre relic, but still old school stuff. 15 out of 49 on this one for Pittsburgh. Uh, Pittsburgh going to who's got the Pittsburgh spot in this one? Jeremy T does. Jeremy T. Treasured materials. Nice looking auto. And the last one. Well, we <laughs> we might be getting an email about this one. We had our Gary Carter super fan chasing down that button a while back. If you guys remember, one of twenty cut signatures booklet. Gary Carter. There it is. Little Expos, which turn into, of course, the Nationals. So the Nationals going to be going to Doug. Gary Carter, and I'm pretty sure that Doug uh, worked a deal with uh, the gentleman previously. One of 20, cut signature booklet. Actually, New York, what am I saying? I'm looking at, uh, hmm, let me take a quick look and see what the checklist actually designates. So the CSB GC1, because on the front of the card, of course, it shows New York. Inside, Montreal. So let me take a quick look and see on the checklist. So CSB-GC1 is the actual card from Panini. So, so Gary Carter... Bear with me one sec. Since it's the last card, I want to notate it in the video. So the cut signatures booklet, according to the checklist, is, yeah, Nationals card. So interesting that it shows the New York designation on the front. But then it shows Montreal, which uh, carries over as the Nationals. So Doug F. on the ownership. And if you guys have any questions on that, feel free to refer to the checklist because that's where I'm checking it out as well. So thanks again, guys. I do appreciate that one being closed out. I'll do the random for that multi-team um, multi booklet, which is in redemption form. I'll do the random as a separate video. So check that one out. It'll be posted in addition to the main video. Have a good one, guys.